Hi guys. So I just thought I'd show you uh, Woodrow here. Um, I just have been putting this little harness on uh, Woodrow for a little while now, just for five minutes here and there. Let him get used to it. And um, by doing this, I can take him for walks, walks around and, um, you know, cause normally he couldn't really come in the kangaroo area because wombats are quite uh, muscly and strong little buggers. And um, he could, you know, run and run into a kangaroo's leg and break a leg. So to let him to walk around out here by himself isn't really the best idea. So, um, yeah, so anyway, this is his first time out walking with his harness on. And um, as you can see, he just doesn't mind it at all. Um, when I first started doing this, I just thought I'll give it a go. And if he's not, if he's not happy with the harness being on, well, I wouldn't do it, but he's never minded the harness being on. And like I said, this is our first time being able to take him out for a walk with it. And as you can see, he's just loving it. He's thinking it's great. He's getting to meet the kangaroos and he's getting to have a good walk. So, and the other reason I wanted to do this as well, if he accepted the harness was um, once he's in his big enclosure, the big enclosure is actually at the front of our house. So if ever the wombats come in the house, I have to carry them in. And um, obviously wombats, once he gets full grown, he's gonna be really heavy. He's gonna be 30, maybe 30 plus kilos. So um, if he's happy to be in a harness, it means I can pop him in the harness and walk him to the house. And I know he's safe, he can't, you know, get away. Whereas like I said, um, you know, I couldn't walk him into the house without anything like this. I'd have to carry him. And uh, yes, like I said, they could be quite heavy. <laughs> so um, yeah, so he's just having a little wander around and absolutely loving it. So um, yeah, I have heard that some wombats just don't like to wear a harness and that's absolutely fine. And that's why, like I said, I, I bought it for him and over the last amount of, uh, X amount of weeks, I've been just popping it on him in the house and just seeing if he is happy with it on and getting used to the feel of it. And this is our first time actually going for a walk. So yeah, so I'm really happy with that because he's not bothered one bit. He's loving it. So um, yeah. Isn't that good, Woodrow? So this is not something I, I would, you know, I wouldn't take him out walking around on the roads or anything like that. This is just to walk him around um, the property, um, you know, just give him some different things to look at. And and when he is in his big enclosure, you know, rather than being stuck in there all the time, I can take him out for walks around the property and keep him his mind fresh. So yeah, very, very happy. And he's loving it, aren't you, baby? Okay, this um, thing is on a slider, so as you can see, I can walk right back here and it just slides. So he basically is not pulling on him at all. It's just there as a as a guide, really. And um, yeah, he just walks where he wants and I follow. Isn't that right, Woodrow? <laughs> here comes somebody to say hello. Hey, Dixie, you coming to say hello? Oh, what's that? And here's Buddy saying hello to Mum. Hey, hello. All right. Yeah, not sure, Dixie. You're not sure what's going on there, Dixie. What is this thing she says? <laughs> All right, Woodrow, we'll keep walking. <laughs> 